what's up everybody this is uh, something new i will start and that is uh, suggesting some gaming channels you or something around gaming or just anything in general on youtube that you should watch and uh, so this is uh, i'm gonna show you 10 things you should watch on youtube and uh, what we start off with here is uh, game theories uh, game theories is a channel that uh, just takes the uh, uh, normal gaming theories you have about a game and takes it to the absurd it ta looks for all the evidence i mean what like, all the fucking evidence it looks through every game in the genre that it's looking through. No, no the game series that it's looking, looking for, and it just turns everything inside out to to get the evidence that it needs. And, and you can see it's it get a lot of views. It get definitely a lot of views for being a gaming channel or channel in general. It got from five hundred, no, six hundred thousand to a million views on its average thing here. I mean, it's just fucking crazy. Uh, so this one, uh, let me read you some titles. Uh, game theory. It's Link dead in my worst mask. Why is Mario mental? Mental. And uh, the T, the TF2 pirate, male or female? Uh, Portal's Companion Cube has a dark secret. Now, Portal Companion's Cube is fucking awesome. You should really watch that episode. And uh, last one, how PewDiePie conquered YouTube. Some real fucking interesting shit when you, uh, I mean, you click on the title and you're like, hmm, this might be a fake title or not that interesting. And then it just blows your fucking mind. I mean, well, okay. Uh, so next thing. Uh, this not my not might become a surprise for you if you're into War Thunder and World of Tanks, but the Mighty Jingles uh, started up a year ago in War Thunder and now in World of Tanks and uh, just expanded ever since. And uh, in a year of YouTube, he has 29 million views and 150 subscribers. Last month, he had 100 subscribers. This is one of those channels that will become really big. Um, yes, okay. Going through my list and I'm trying to find something that you will like. <laughs> Not that you would like, but I mean, it's interesting. Sea Nanners. Sea Nanners are one of the more very popular, very widely known. But something that I really think you should check out is his um, uh, animations. Now you won't see it because uh, the window don't go down, but this is what I'm talking about. Uh, so what he done is that he played his games. Uh, I'm not going to show the clip, but as you can see here, his uh, animation. And that is something you really should check out. Um, it just, he plays this game, have fun, uh, have fun with his friends, and then post uh, videos, and then sometimes he make an animation of what he just played. Uh, okay. And uh, the fourth thing, Total Biscuit, Cynical Brit. Uh, he does, if you're interested in, interested in indie games, you should really check out his uh, WT, WTF is. Now, he does a lot more than that. He does, like, for, his, for example, he does Bioshock Burial, let's see, as you can see here. Uh, he does Content Patch, which is a news show. Uh, he, he's been on since 2000, not from the start of uh, YouTube, and he's, he's really well known in the World of Warcraft circles, but outside, not very well known. Very good player, very good person. I, yeah, okay. IGN. Uh, now, IGN sucks, so I just clicked on it by mistake, but you should not watch IGN. It, it's, it's not a good way. It's, here, here's a normal IGN review of a game. I'll bet you that you can find a single IGN video where it's um, where they have a lower score of seven from one to ten. I mean, though it's it's your average sellout gamer. Okay. Next thing, uh, number five, uh, pistol shrimps. Uh, what they do is they gone. You know those videos when they have a voiceover from a famous video. When golden stars. You see, they copy in their own, and they do it very good. I mean, this is one of the most skilled people on YouTube copying in uh, their own acting and the um, the quality of uh, the production in this is amazing and the humor of them is just incredible okay next thing let's see what we got here in my subscribers well not the subscribers here's the thing uh, the escapist now I spelled it wrong but here's the escapist the escapist, escapist magazine now you'll probably know Escapist from uh, one of their most popular uh, shows and that is Zero Punction. Now I don't watch the rest except for the Inquisition. I don't watch the rest of them. Uh, Zero Punction is the most hilarious game reviewing show ever. If you don't like your games being criticized, well you shouldn't watch this thing because he just rips them apart. If you ever love the game, you should never watch his reviews because he will just cut them up. But if you hate a game, you should definitely watch the game review he made about it. It comes out every week, it's very nice. Okay, and... Uh, well, let me just show you uh, what I mean. And his playstyle. And let's... Uh... Well, I don't know what you're talking about. I've been playing Beyond. Beyond what? Beyond the limits of social acceptability? No, I mean, I've been playing Two Souls. Oh, right, isn't that that really hard game from Buy Software? I mean, Buy From Software. No, that's Dark Souls. Oh, so you were playing some kind of game about the exploration of several human sphincters. No. Okay, so that is something you should really check out. Uh, okay, and um, let's... What do we got more? Well, here's something else you should try out. Penny Arcade. 
Now, Penny Arcade has uh, yeah, this thing going on, and that is extra credits. If you want to be a designer, if you want to work with games in general, this is something like uh, Zero Puncture, except it's a educational videos and not uh, not comedy. So, and they also do something like this. They do uh, suggestions on what games you should play. Uh, it's if you if you ever want to work with games in any way, this is something you really should watch too, or just uh, browse through their videos and see if there's something else you like. And uh, yeah, okay. Well, what do we got more? Uh, well, this is probably something else I know, and that is. Now I'm gonna take up something that I don't like. Uh, three games that I, four games that I don't like. First of all, Angry Yo. Angry Yo. <laughs> Not gonna show you this. Angry Yo does this thing where he makes this green thing, uh, like pistol shrimps, but he does angry reviews. Okay, that's something weird. He does this uh, angry reviews where he stands in front of the game while it's being played or something in front of a something well he got a production quality of zero his it just sucks and the audio quality and the video quality sucks <laughs> okay now let's check out pewdiepie pewdiepie is since he came out with, like uh, with the amnesia videos he i mean from the beginning he he had some good stuff but the problem with pewdiepie is he haven't evolved from, uh, oh, no, that's the wrong thing. Let's check my oldest too. I mean, since the beginning, he have not evolved from what he's, what he's been doing. He's been doing the same shit for... Okay, so he haven't done any shit for uh, new shit for years. I mean, he j just the same old shit. And uh, the third shitty thing you should not watch. Well, the first six things were good things. Here, the last things are bad things. Uh, here's Toby. Toby copies everything he sees on the internet and takes the concept and does it himself and he does it in such a shitty way and before he was very popular now not very much i, I think I'm, I'm not big on it but i think that his um, viewers got stolen by um, pewdiepie if there's even such a thing as getting stolen uh, and the last thing that you should not watch is jogcast i can't go in, go into everything he does but Hello. everything they does is well it's basically a cult per, per, of personality ever there's this, they're the same thing as PewDiePie and Toby, but they do the same thing as um, they do the same thing as them. But they, what they do is they have more people doing it. And uh, now they have, they have reviews of different mods in Minecraft and stuff like that. And uh, not very much innovation going on, just the same thing over and over again. Uh, the more Minecraft, mo the new Minecraft mods make it some interesting things, but you don't want to watch that. So uh, this has been Marcus Freelance. Uh, like this video, subscribe to this video if you really like it. If you have any criticism. Uh, please tell me if uh, there's something I should improve on. If you think uh, I unfairly criticized something or I uh, gave something too much credit, uh, tell me. I want to know everything you think about it. Uh, thank you for watching.